Hi, this is Lauren Cheek from Lauren Acopia. And uh, a friend of mine sent me a photo of Lata Cheek, who was uh, more or less a model in New York. She was from Georgia. And he asked me if <clears throat> she was a cousin of mine. So I researched into it. And uh, I've seen a couple of blogs this week about Lata. She's very beautiful if you look her up. And people can't believe that her name was actually Lata Cheek. But people in my family have interesting senses of humor uh in fact there's another cousin whose name was e pluribus unum cheek but uh to give you an idea lotta and i are cousins she is descended from william martin cheek which is about my sixth grandfather back he was a uh revolutionary war soldier in south carolina and the family moved into uh kind of western south carolina and then when indian territory opened up after 1840 they ended up in north georgia around uh elberton franklin county the counties were all one county and they split so anyway lotta is descended from william martin cheek through burgess holland cheek burgess holland cheek was the uh full brother of my ancestor Roland and then his son was Henry Cheek Henry Cheek's son was uh, John Harris Cheek John Harris Cheek's son was Leon Cheek and then Leon Cheek had children and one of the children was Lotta Cheek so that's where she came from uh, she's descended from a long line of families that go all the way back to uh, Robert de Hole in 1209 in Shropshire England the Cheeks of Modestone Sir John Cheek, who was the uh, educator of King Edward, Henry VIII's son, and Elizabeth I, and Mary, all kings and queens of England. Uh, so she's a direct descendant as I am. I'm a male line descendant all the way back, definitely to 1209. And then our family is descended from uh, William de Bouvelin, who's descended from the Harcourts, who were Normans, who were descended from uh, Bernard the Dane, who was the brother-in-law of Rollo. Rollo and Bernard the Dane uh, <clears throat> were married to sisters. <laughs> so Bernard actually ended up being uh, more or less the regent, for Rollo's son uh, when Rollo died young and left his son young. And that comes all the way down through the Harcourts to the to the Boot Valens, uh at the Norman Conquest to 1209 in Shropshire, all the way through Shropshire to uh, the Isle of Wight. Uh, we once owned uh, what is now Osborne House. We also owned uh, Wolfston, which is in, oh gosh, Southampton, I want to say. It's where uh, the Titanic was launched from. That uh, tenement still exists. Uh, and we also owned uh, Duchecken Hall, which is now called Chikenell, and it's in Shropshire, and the property exists, and the church that our ancestors attended also is there um, in that area. So it's a long history uh, of a very beautiful lady. But if you wanted to know more about her background, I'm looking into what happened to her. But that's where she came from. Thanks for watching.